Hello and welcome to Lake Street News. I'm your host, Matthew. And I'm your other host, Zach. Today we've got some great stories about rubber ducks, elementary schools, protesting, and more. Nearly 60 first graders at Bell Sherman Elementary recently had a peaceful protest march. The first graders marched around Bell Sherman holding signs that said, Stop Racism, Black Lives Matter, Enough is Enough, and more. During the all-school assembly, the first graders performed anti-racist and human rights poems and music by both important artists and themselves. Many Ithaca High School students were shocked when administration recently installed yet another fence to block those cutting through the arts quad. The gray metal fence installed behind the orange plastic fence only guards the sidewalk on the arts quad, meaning that many students who need to get to classes on time can still cut through the easily bendable orange fence. An Instagram account, IHS Fence Updates, has been created and has become popular overnight, reaching more than 150 followers, with only a few posts. In other news, Tompkins County 4-H Youth Development held their own annual duck race fundraiser last weekend. With over 3,000 rubber ducks competing in the event, watchers of the race had one quack of a time down in Cascadilla Gorge. The winning ducks have not been announced by 4-H yet, but prizes donated by local businesses go up to $500 for the first place winner. All proceeds from the 4-H duck race will go directly into supporting 4-H youth development programs. Thanks for watching Lake Street News. And have a good day. And also, please join this club. We only had like three people show up today. I know, it's crazy. It's yeah. Mr. Shine's fault. Yeah, it really, like why? Why would he do that? Why does Mr. Shine, why is he at the yeah. school? He should be. I mean, like, I'm still freaking out about Jeremy Jordan. You know? Who? Jeremy Jordan. Uh, yeah. Yeah. yeah.